now that I have placed my light fixtures and ceilings, the next thing I need to do is add some light switches and show the electrical connection to those switches. So I'm going to come to the Insert tab, come here to Load Autodesk Family, and then I'm going to come here to the Electrical category and scroll down until I find the light switch. I'm just going to load this switch single in real quick. And then now, when I come to components, I have my single switch. So I'm just going to add a light switch right here for my kitchen. Now you'll notice that I clicked and it doesn't look like anything showed up. The switch is actually there, but we just can't see it because it's not visible in our view. By default, the switch goes in about four feet and our cut plane on our ceiling plan is not set that low. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here to Properties and we're going to scroll down until I find my view range. I'm going to hit Edit. And you see right here that our cut plane is set at 7 foot 6. I'm going to switch this to 4 feet and hit OK. And you'll see that my switch appears and now also my doors are appearing because we lowered that cut plane. The next thing we're going to do is I'm going to come here to the Annotate tab. I'm going to gr grab a detail line and I am just going to grab a hidden line and just use the three-point arc to connect the light fixtures that I want to control with that switch. So I'm just going to connect all my can lights right here. And then I will just do that for all of my switches. The last thing I want to point out is we also want to see what's going on in our first floor. So if you've noticed that you can see my table and my cabinets, and some of the other furniture that I've placed. This is done because I have my underlay on, so I'm just going to make sure that I want this set to L1, looking to L2 and looking down, and hit apply, and that will add an underlay which will show me what's going on on my first floor plan. And if I didn't want this, I would just change that to none, and that would change it. But I want to be able to see where I've laid stuff out so that I know where to place my light fixtures. So I'm just going to quickly turn that back on.